Breaks down wrestling matches better than anyone else. Roy Hunter is here. Give us the tail of the tape. Yes, David. Now, I wasn't kidding. I actually did take some mescaline before tonight's event, David. But tonight's tail of the tape is showing Dark Oracle Sage with almost a full foot height advantage, David, as well as almost 100 pounds weight advantage. Normally, this would be an issue. However, Casey Bonilla hails from the Bronx. And that should kind of even things out considerably. I'm calling this match Clash of the Chitons with a K. Because both warriors have the letter K located somewhere in their name. Back to you, David. <laughs> okay. Let's, okay, the producers are telling me that we are ready for the match. I believe it's going to start imminently. And here we go. And here comes Casey Bonilla to the ring. Straight out of the Bronx, New York. Look at this young man, the girls love him. He will be combating Dark, Oracle, Sage. You know, David? Oh, oh there he is. You know, we, we very rarely address the wrestler's intro music. Uh, while we may not get along on a personal level, I will admit that Dark Oracle Sage has one of the best opening tracks in the IWF. Take a listen, David. I mean, Dark Oracle Sage with tremendous mystery tremendous darkness and this is an extremely impressive entrance tonight let's soak this in a little bit yeah dark oracle sage was iwf's wrestler of the year in 2019 and 2020 david i believe this is entirely due to the fact that he consistently gets away with throwing me around the gym but if he does it for me again i will be pressing charges i assure you Back to you, David. Okay, okay, what, okay, okay. Let's ignore what Roy just said, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. The ring, the the, 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 the bell is rung, and the match is about to begin. Dark Oracle Sage on your left. Casey Bonilla on your right. You can clearly see the physical advantage that Dark Oracle Sage is, and he runs in, but nobody home, Roy. Nobody home at all, David. I, you know, just looking at Dark Oracle Sage here, I'm totally expecting him to go into a... Can you dig it, monologue a la Warriors? Check it out. He's got that Cyrus kind of vibe. Dark Oracle <laughs> Sage has Casey Bonilla. And go! Oh, Casey Bonilla gets out of what looked like a backdrop. He lands on his feet. Now Casey Bonilla has a headlock, a left-handed headlock on Dark Oracle Sage, who looks like he was trying for an Irish whip, but could not get Bonilla against the ropes again. It looks like Sage is going for an Irish whip, but Bonilla blocks with his feet, Roy. Locks with his feet. Oh, okay. It looks like he's going for a... Is that a Kimura, David? Is that a Kimura now? That is just your standard headlock, Roy. Just your standard headlock that Casey Bonilla is administering to Dark Oracle Sage, who now has Bonilla in backdrop position and connects with Ow. a devastating backdrop, Roy. Wow. Both men have some truly glorious hair, David. According to their bios here, Dark Oracle Sage has been using Perk Plus for years, while Casey, <laughs> Casey Bonilla is actually considering an endorsement deal by L'Oreal Paris Tone Repair, probably due to the curls, David. Big-time left-handed blows from Dark Oracle Sage as our co-host and announcer Roy Harder has lost his mind, unfortunately, once again live on the air as Sage rains down big, heavy left hands onto Casey Bonilla's head. And right now we're seeing the physical domination of, oh, of Sage, but look at Bonilla fighting back. But no, Sage cuts him down, Roy. Not quite, David. Yeah, I'm actually just getting word uh, that Casey Bonilla is known as supersonic Casey Bonilla, David. I think he should have called himself, well, hear me out here, Casey Godzilla Vanilla. It's got a much better rhyming scheme. What do you think? Okay, awful, awful. No one knows what he's talking about. The Spanish pronunciation for that name is Bonilla, so Godzilla would not rhyme with it. It would have to be Godzilla Bonilla. And I apologize for following Roy down this psychedelic wormhole. Uh, it's just deep regrets and deep, deep apologies to everyone watching right now. Here comes Dark Oracle Sage. He's against the rope, and oh, man, he just jumps right on the back of KC Bonilla, who is left lifeless on the mat. Dark Oracle Sage imposing brutality, ferocity, dare I even say savagery, onto Casey Bonilla, the youngster. This is just 
his second match, his phoniest second match of his career role. You know, interesting story, David. A little, little side, side here, but uh, you know, my son walked in on me and my wife, uh, quote unquote, wrestling on the bed a couple nights ago. We call it wrestling because he can't pronounce jujitsu. <laughs> oh my God! Okay, first of all, that's so disturbing, and second of all, I'm pretty sure you said that four matches ago. But <laughs> here comes Saint. <laughs> He's got Casey Bone. Oh my God! Sage with just a, a, a just a ridiculous drop to the mat of Casey Bonilla. That's got to be it. That's got to be the end of Bonilla, Roy. I, I think that looked like uh, some sort of illegal threat when he was doing that, David. I don't know if that's allowed, but uh, well, I think that's just, that, that's catch just it. elementary uh, uh, um, taunting, Roy. That's just a gesture, you know, like imparting to the galaxy. That's a symbol. That's all that is. That's nothing. That's nothing illegal. Uh, oh, Casey Bonilla pushes. Oh, a toe Ooh. drag by Casey Bonilla on the Dark Oracle stage. I could not envision this. I could not envision Casey Bonilla with a comeback and Bonilla I, from the I second row. Oh, oh, for years. What? Oh, my God. Oh, my God, Roy. Okay, we have ourselves a match. This thing has really picked up. And a step up in security by Casey Bonilla. He's got Dark Oracle Sage to the mat where he wants him. What's Bonilla going to do next, Roy? You know, I, I don't know what he's going to do next, but I often wonder why wrestlers are always fighting for a belt when they don't have any loops on their pants. Crossbody! Oh, he missed! He missed the crossbody, Roy. I'm sorry, but I had to break in. The move is huge. Casey Bonilla went for a top rope crossbody. He nobody home. Wow. And there's a Michinoku driver from Dark Oracle Sage. That could be it. That will be it. A three count. That's it. It's oh. over. Dark Oracle Sage with the, woo, that was a tough victory. Give KC Bonilla tons of credit for fighting, for coming back at the end. I thought there was no chance. Oh, Dark Oracle Sage not pleased with the referee. Didn't even want his arm raised. And Did you just see a dragon evil. fly by? I just saw, a, I'm pretty sure I just saw a rainbow colored dragon fly by the screen. <laughs> Dark Oracle Sage, um, just unbelievable. Woo! What a match. Roy, thoughts about that? That was definitely a dragon. There's a, there it goes again. Meant, you didn't see that? I meant, I, I meant thoughts about the match. <laughs> I know you're taking some drugs. You're probably still high. I really like Dark Oracle Robert Sage's Hunt. music, David. The music, Dark Oracle Sage's music is pretty exceptional. I will give him that. But that's okay. all I'm giving him. All right. Fair enough. Yeah.